Here's your news around the Pacific. I'm Sergeant Jacob Colvin. In the Republic of Korea, U.S. Navy Mobile Diving Salvage Unit 1 is training with their ROC counterparts during Salvage Exercise 2019. This year is the 35th iteration of Salvex and focuses on combined diving operations and subject matter expert exchanges. Divers from both navies participated in training scenarios including the use of sonar imaging and remote operated vehicles. Pacific Partnership is bringing together nations from across the region. This year marks the 14th iteration of the largest multilateral humanitarian assistance and disaster relief preparedness mission in the Indo-Pacific region. On the construction site, we have Staff Sergeant Emily Koontz to tell us more. Here in Taklavan City, CBs with Naval Mobile Construction Battalion 3 have been hard at work alongside their Philippine counterparts. For over the past month, they've been working on this multi-purpose room for the local community as a part of Pacific Partnership 2019. Also during Pacific Partnership, healthcare professionals worked together to host a community health engagement. The team provided medical services and education to the local population. They also teamed up to provide veterinarian services for the local dog population to reduce the spread of diseases. Because uh, population control is one of the ways to control rabies. By uh, castrating dogs, their population will decrease, and at the same time, castrating them is one way to eradicate rabies. In the Philippine Sea, Task Force 70 conducted a missile exercise to increase the tactical proficiency, lethality, and interoperability of the participating units. The U.S. Navy warships trained together to fire a variety of different weapon systems. That's your news around the Pacific. For more stories like these, like and follow your Department of Defense Facebook page. See you next time.